Western Sahara keeps on making diplomatic victories and strengthening the positions of African countries, pleading for its people to free the Sahrawis from illegal occupation of the Moroccan forces. South Africa and Tanzania reaffirmed their support for the Sahrawi self-determination in a joint statement that followed the visit of Tanzanian President Samia Suluhu Hassan to Pretoria by holding the referendum in accordance with the decisions of the African Union and the United Nations. We also had an opportunity to exchange views on regional, continental and global issues of mutual interest. Among others, we reaffirmed our shared resolve to ensure that the people of Western Sahara are able to exercise their right to self-determination. We will resist any efforts to frustrate the legitimate aspirations of the Sahrawi people or to diminish their standing within the African Union. The pivotal African support for the Sahrawi issue comes after Kenya, Angola and South Sudan reiterated their support to Western Sahara. This confirms the African leaders and people's loyalty to the principles of liberation and ending the last occupation of the African continent. The Sahrawi issue gained international political, diplomatic and judicial recognition from more than 80 countries around the world, as well as the United Nations bodies and committees led by the Special Committee of Decolonization. The Polisario Front, however, insists that the struggle continues until the independence is taken from the Moroccan occupation.